How many days after you guys like grout it do you have to wait till we test? So initially we drill the hole, we fill it up with grout, then the next day we come in post grout. So it's pressure grout so we can take care of all the voids inside the tie back. So, so when you grout it originally to post grout, like what do you mean, what's the difference? So when you first grout it, you're grouting it, you're filling it with concrete. Right. And then you come the next day to post grout it, what does that mean when you so post grout So any imperfections, because yes. you have a column all the way down, right? Yes. So any imperfections, the like post grout, a void, a void okay. they'll take care of that void and it's 100%, you know what I mean? Okay. Full grout it. Okay. So that's what a post grout does. So after that, if you use a type two, type five, which is normally regular, after the post grout, 72 hours, then you come back and, and test. And start testing. Or if, if your grout, your grout, so the plants, sometimes they change, it might have like, your strength of your grout be 3,000, 4,000, 5,000 PSI. So yes. whenever you get that, that uh, the cure time, once you get that, then you can start testing. And you guys hand mix that grout, right? No, we use a, a or grout a machine? pump. Okay, we a use a grout pump. pump. Okay. So now. Does the machine automatically give gives you, you volume? You gives you volume. So volume you could say, hey, I need this much and this much Correct. to make this 100. kind of PSI? 100. Okay. Yeah. And then right now we're just testing, a re getting a reading of the tie back. Okay. So we're pretty close to 100% right now. 